Hey guys and welcome to the day 448 vlog Alright, so as you probably may have heard um, The good news um, as well is that um, Ella Short has actually finally left SCFC Finally, he's officially fucking left and, uh, and after all this time That all these fans have been saying Oh Ella Short just need to fuck off Short out, short out, fuck off Now everybody can stop talking about it Because you know why? Because he's actually fucked off And I'm happy that he's actually got rid of the club Well, sold the club and actually, um, like, gave it to somebody who could actually be a little bit more better. Stuart Donald, I don't know much about him, but he better do a lot more better than a fucking American cunt known as Ella Short. He actually needs to do a fucking better job than him. Oh, and, um, I'd just like to say, um, to, um, to Chris Coleman and to, um, to his assistant... Um, hope you do well in your future endeavours and um, hope you do a better than um, another club because um, as you may not have known Chris Coleman was actually released from his contract um, because um, because I think Stuart um, Donald actually wants to start fresh now plus now he can because Ellis Short has finally decided to grow some Balls and actually fucking peel off the entire fucking debt Which he should have done in the first place because otherwise we wouldn't have been in this fucking mess Ellis Short if you were paid off the fucking debt earlier than that You would have been all right, but now you're not So but thank God the two things and things that you've done in the ten years that we've been suffering underneath you is that you've left and you've paid off the entire debt. Those are the only two decent things that you've done. <sighs> but, from one cunt to another. Jack fucking Robwell. We need to get rid of him. We need to get rid of Jack fucking Robwell. Even Chris Coleman actually stated that, um, that where is he now? That where is it, that he's not even playing for the first squad. He's not even training with them. So why the fuck have we still got him? Jesus Christ. Oh, and also the fact is, is that the club actually um, put out um, a statement. Um, saying that the fact is, is that um, Ellis Short has actually said it himself. That his chairmanship is actually not being that great. Uh... Not being that great. You don't need to be Sherlock to actually figure that one out. If you've been um, a Sunderland fan whilst under his um, rule, well, well, whilst underneath him for that decade, then I feel sorry for each and every single Sunderland fan that was underneath him, including myself um, as well. Because you weren't the only one guys that actually wanted him to be out there was a lot of people in Sunderland that actually wanted him gone and guess what he's gone how we can all get the flags out and be happy and obviously enough we're gonna have to start a new in League One fucking twice that we've been in fucking League One god I just hope and pray and Stuart Donald knows what he's doing. He can actually pick up the scraps them again and start getting us back into the fucking championship. And then after that, probably get us back into the fucking Premier League game as well. Which I doubt it like. Now we're just like... Now the question is... Who's actually going to be our new manager for the next league? Because I know Robbie Stockdale is actually taking over for the last match. Just the last match. That's that's all. The last match in the fucking championship. Which is actually no point, actually. There's no point to it anyways. Wolves have actually won it. They're getting promoted straight away. They've secured with their spot in the Premier League. Cardiff have secured their um, spot them as well, and I would just like to say to those two teams, good luck in the Premier League.
Um, and um, we're relegated. We're fucking relegated. <sighs> well, I don't know who could actually be joining us anyways. But I would just like to say this. Um, hope we get back into the championship. And I hope Stuart Donald actually invests money into this club. Now I hope he actually does a better job than Alice fucking short. The fucking American cunt. And I'm glad that he's fucked up back to America. He can actually stay there for all I fucking care. So. So yeah. I'm in a happy mood that he's actually gone. So. Do that. And hopefully, Sunderland will actually do better in League One and get us back into the championship. Come on, lads, we can fucking do this. Oh, and um, I forgot to actually say this video is actually going to be split into two parts because in this part, I um, actually take. Talk to him a little bit about that uh, that that um, Sunderland thing. Now for the second part of the video, it's all about the Avengers. So stay tuned for that part. Peace.